The music also the present Uzbekistan rests on these century old traditions. The most ancient monuments of the material culture and written resources have already been indicative of a great importance of music in the life of Central Asia peoples. The best samples of music art are elucidated in the treatises about music, which were written by famous Middle Asian scientists, encyclopedias, Al Farabi, Ibn Sina, Al Khorazmi, and others. The basis of Uzbek national music includes diatonic and some chromatic elements. The changeability of tune and modulation are widely used. The rhythmic basis of folk sound distinguishes with great variety. As a result of ethnic community, there are four basic local musical styles in Uzbekistan. They are Khorezm, Bukharas Nakhan, Sultan Dariya and Sultan Dariya the songs are divided according to when and where they are sung, either ceremonial or songs which are sung at any time. For sure, it is everyday songs with melody of a small diapason expressed in the verses texts of Urubai, Lafar and Yanda, on tropical songs to be in the company of dances and dreams. Ashiva is a lyric song though, in co-written with display melody of a wide diapason. The most ancient music form of Uzbek traditional music is Makon. Some of its parts have a century old history. The expert of Makon's Yunus Rajabi proves that Makon had appeared in the 19th century. There are several traditional Makons which are connected with different regions of Uzbekistan. It may take many hours to sing one whole code of Makons. Makom are the classical heritage of Uzbek music art. Till present days, they guide composers and singers as worthy temple, while creating modern works. Remain till our days, Makoms are the codes of instrumental, dance, and vocal music. There is a wide usage of both soul and ensemble components of music works. The characteristic feature of Uzbek ensemble is the play in music. The notation in music practice in the past actually was not used. Glorified masters told folklore professional musicians from generation to generation. That's why the professional study gathering and records of traditional instrumental music and in dances in Uzbekistan set about only in the previous century. A great contribution was made in the matter of comprehension and creative development of this wide part of people's traditional culture by a gifted singer, Muhadim Qari Yaqubu, a dancer, Tamara Hanum, and composer, Yunus Rajabi. They began their activities in the 20s of the 20s century. Making up of national music instruments turns into a special people's business into the branch of the creative applied arts with its own ways of making a decorating instrument. One must need special people to do it. The following music instruments are rich in variety. String boat, rejack, Kobus, sitar, string plug, dumbra, dutor, tambur, oud, rubob, string percussion, chime, wind cane, bolaman, surnai, koshnai, wind flute, nai, rajernai, wind kuf, karnai, percussion membrane, doira, nahara, chindaul, and others. Doira and Karnai are special popular people's instruments of Uzbekistan. Without them, none of the orchestra is considered to be complete. Doira is the simple leader and ring with the wooden wheel. A lot of ringing colored wings are fastened to the back side of the 